Welcome back into NBA Playgrounds. And it is week number four. Rio de Janeiro. TV Sports 27. And we got the first of a couple of one and two battles here. This one between Six and Iron Men. And we talked about in game one the importance of this battle. Because the losing squad is going to drop down to one and three. And if you lose six games, you're eliminated from the postseason. Six losses, you're out, six wins, and you're in. So, week four, super important game. Six versus Iron Man. Remember, first bucket is going to get three points here. And we got Kevin McHale, Def Lep Shrimp on six. And on the Iron Man squad, Gary Payton and John Stockton. If you're a first-time viewer, six, of course, for the best six-man players in NBA history. But we've yet to have a score yet. 30 seconds into this one. Oh, my goodness. And the Iron Men, or, of course, I mean, that pretty much explains itself. The most minutes played, the most years played, the most durable. The guys that are have seen the court for a very, very, very long time. As we said, minutes, years, months, games played, those are the Iron Men. So, of course, Iron Men led by Kevin Garnett, Jason Kidd, John Stockton, Gary Payton, and six. I'm gonna get to that in a second. Oh, lost, lost the ball there. Six, Kevin McHale, Def Lep Shrimp, John Halavik, and Ricky Pierce. So sloppy play, sloppy play to begin this one, I guess. I suppose that's why both teams are one and two and more missed shots. The, the field goal percentage is, is not good. So that is a guaranteed shot from anywhere when you get that power up. And unlike LeBron in game one, well, Gary Payton takes advantage with a three-point shot and stolen away by Stockton. Ten to two right now for the Iron Men. And they stop the hurt to six a little bit with that jumper. Kevin McHale in your Celtics green and white. Def Lep Shrimp in your Portland Trailblazers red and black. And of course, Gary Payton with his Sunday night, uh, Sunday night heat, his Miami heat gear. Meanwhile, John Stockton with that beautiful Utah Jazz, purple and blue with the mountains. Fantastic uniform. Double point opportunity here. There you go, there's four. So this is, this is the time you get those power-ups here in NBA Playgrounds. That can make it or break it for you, folks. There you go. Two-point shot. But a tie game right here. If this three-pointer gets hit, Def Lep Shrimp just... That was not good. And I do not think they're going to have enough time. They got nine seconds if they want to try to make this thing happen to try to get that six-point shot. Time will tick away. Peyton, fall away, fade away, no good. Man, look at the defense right now by the Iron Men. And Kevin McHale just had to fight his way through that shot. Did he not get to go 16-14? Oh, hello, Luna. Luna, the official mascot of TV Sports 27, joining us here. Def Lep Shrimp. Well guarded, but he's able to get the soccer ball to go. The Rio de Janeiro soccer ball. I'm surprised that thing has much bounce to it. Gary Payton for two. 21-16 for the Iron Men. From the free throw line. We don't have any free throws. We don't slow the game down for nothing in NBA Playgrounds. No free throws. Would you guys like if they just got rid of free throws in the NBA? Forget about it. It slows it down. We got the pitch clock in baseball. There's no free throws. Ooh, double point opportunity. So, man, they're getting gifted right now by the playground gods with these multiple point opportunities, allowing them 
to work their way back into the game for six. And Def left Shrimp, but they're losing a lot of their time here. Gary Payton strikes just before time ticks down. And, well, there you go. They got the, the, the six-pointer, but they got the ice bucket. So they're going to have to break that with three shots. So that's going to kind of screw six. Oh, a collision. And the Iron Man himself, Gary Payton, comes in with the score. Big shout out to those of you watching in the chat. K Duckman, glad to have you aboard here on Twitch. Gary Payton. No thought better of it. Stocked in. Knock Shrimp and Kevin Minichael. How many times has Mikhail and Shrimp been knocked to the uh, the beach floor here in Rio? That broke. That was only okay. Maybe that was three. Shrimp, no. Both one and two squads here. Gary Payton. Oh, knocked away by Shrimp. Def left Shrimp, one of uh, Pawnee, Indiana's favorite favorite NBA players. McHale wants it. Beautiful, beautiful dunk by Kevin McHale. Under four to play. It's kind of our witching hour when you get to that four minute mark here. All right, <laughs> anything could happen. Come on guys, and here comes Shrimp. Puts it home for two. And now another gift of the gods here. Four point slam dunk opportunity for six. But they're down by 10. Let's see, can they get these dunks to go? Oh! Mikhail got a little too excited. Sloppy play from six. Peyton, they're going to only give him two on that one. And he lets go of it. Man, it's four-point opportunity with the dunk, and six doesn't take it. And they get a three-pointer. Big blowout here. What have you guys been watching lately? What, uh... We got a big NXT coming up, which we're going to be watching right after this. A lot of people are going to be moving up to the old main roster. Lots of NXT draft picks. That means there's going to be new blood coming in. A lot of people talking about the NHL playoffs. Some of the crazy upsets in the first round. I'm watching the Cubs game right now. Up one, or They're actually losing 1-0 to the Nationals. Wininski's actually had one of his better pitching performances. He's usually not been doing too good this season, but this one's looking good. And looks like they're about to go to the pen. XFL Championship next weekend. They get a week off to rest. Defenders, which it's, it's still crazy. The the DC Defenders 10-1 and one in their one loss to Orlando. Get out of here. 42-33 and another double point opportunity. They gotta do the crossover move, though. Which, actually, I'm not even quite sure how to do that. Is it with the stick? Perhaps? I don't know how to do the crossover. Should I look at the rules here? <laughs> Part... Alright, how do we do, uh... Uh... Cr it is! Okay, I was doing the right stick, and it wasn't doing it. Maybe I just gotta... I gotta put a little more finesse on it, huh? Pretty big lead! For the Iron Men. Peyton was trying to just put this one away with another three. And there's the crossover now. They're going to give him double points for that. I didn't see the ball on fire. Judges say no. Even though we crossed him up. That's a... That might be a controversial call. But that is the playground gods make the decision there. But here come six. They're working their way back into this one. Shrimp. Boy, uh, John Stockton, we're going to have to look at his stats. I feel like he's gotten at least like 10 blocks in this one. Gary Payton working the outside of the arc here, coming back in. Stockton bouncing back, fighting with McHale. And even with Kevin McHale in his face, not a problem to get that shot to drop. Unbelievable shrimp for two. 
They're closing the gap a little bit. They got a minute. If they can get a few turnovers here. Mikhail, I think he just got a hand on that. But the rebound by Peyton. And a, a good defensive block there by Shrimp. Deflep Shrimp. Layup. They got superpowers now. And it is a five-point game. Less than a minute to go. Oh, but there's the two. We're back up to seven. Super speed, super fast. Wonder if they think about trying to three at some point with these, these super abilities. They are going to try it. No, Gary Payton. That looked like that was going to drop too. That hit right in the middle, 44%. And Gary Payton to put the game on ice, followed up by a John Stockton shot. And now they're just jacking up threes. Five points to play. Super speed as well. And it's not looking good. If you're a fan, yeah, that's going to do it. So there's a win for the Iron Men. And Six is going to find themselves in a tough position here. As they are going to drop down to one and three. And they are three losses away from postseason elimination. There you can see the amount of blocks. He only gives Stockton two. He had a bunch of them. I don't care what they say. Gary Payton, 34 points. Forget about it. All right. That is going to wrap up this game, this episode. But we'll be back. We got game three from Rio. We got more NBA playgrounds coming your way in just a few moments.